Only on 13, a Houston police officer's off the job and under investigation accused of participating in a car theft ring. ABC 13's Jessica Willie is live with what police say was found on the officer's phone and his status now at the department. Jessica? Yeah, auto theft is one of those crimes that has only increased over the last few years. Police often target auto theft rings. Well, tonight, investigators believe Officer Keith Roy Jr. used HPD equipment and police access to get information for suspected car thief. This is not the first time this has happened at HPD. It probably won't be the last time this happens at HPD. Houston Police Officer Keith Roy Jr. seen here on his LinkedIn page is off Houston's streets tonight and away from his police duties. The 43 year old is under investigation for his alleged ties to an auto theft ring. I bet you they're wondering how often he's done this. According to a search warrant signed Monday, HPD's special investigations unit wants full access to Roy's phone. Video, photographs, text messages, call history, GPS data, and any social media posts or messaging contained within. During the course of an auto theft ring investigation, the affidavit says Roy was implicated. They got the search warrant for the suspect's phone, and in the process of searching that phone, they found information about the officer or from the officer that was of a confidential nature that the suspect should not have been in possession of. According to the affidavit, the suspect texted an image of a specific Texas license plate to Roy's phone. The response to that text was, quote, got it, along with an image of the vehicle registration on a police car computer. The affidavit states investigators determined Roy was at work that day, logged in and had run that registration. With that information, former HPD officer turned lawyer Tom Nixon says a car thief could then easily go find it. You're not supposed to share that with anyone other than another government agency. In response, Houston police would only say that Roy Jr. is relieved of duty pending the outcome of an investigation. He has been with the department since 2011 and is assigned to the Traffic Enforcement Division. ABC 13's attempts to reach the officer were not successful. He has not been charged with a crime, Nixon says, that's likely coming soon. The search warrant, he says, says a lot. He's certainly acquainted with people who are engaged in organized criminal activity. And consequently, uh, the department has a problem with information not being held securely by its own employees. Jessica Willie, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.